Helen McCrory, star of Peaky Blinders and Harry Potter, dies aged 52 The actor Helen McCrory has died at the age of 52. McCrory was best known for her roles in the films The Queen and The Special Relationship and the Harry Potter franchise and TV series including Peaky Blinders. He her husband, fellow actor Damien Lewis, confirmed her death via Twitter saying that McCrory had died peacefully at home. Lewis said, I'm heartbroken to announce that after an heroic battle with cancer, the beautiful and mighty woman, that is Helen McCrory has died, surrounded by a wave of love from friends and family. He added, that his wife had died as she lived. Fearlessly. God we love her, and know how lucky we are to have had her in our lives. She blazed so brightly. Go now little one into the air, and thank you. Born in London to a Welsh mother and Scottish-born father, McCrory spent a year in Italy before studying acting at the Drama Centre. Her film roles included portraying Cherry Blair in Peter Morgan's The Queen and The Special Relationship in 2006 and 2010 respectively. She also played Narcissa Malfoy in the final three films in the Harry Potter franchise, and appeared in the James Bond film Skyfall. On television, she had a leading role as the Shelby's matriarch Polly Gray in the BBC's period crime drama Peaky Blinders, and appeared in series including Doctor Who, Inside No. 9, His Dark Materials and Penny Dreadful. Peaky Blinders began filming a sixth series earlier this year, expected to air later in 2021 with McCrory understood to have reprised her role. In 2020, she appeared in the Hugh Laurie political drama Roadkill on the BBC and ITV's Quiz. McCrory was also an accomplished stage actor and was nominated for an Olivier for her stage role as Rosalind in As You Like It in at London's Wyndham's Theatre in 2006. In 2020, McCrory and Lewis led fundraising efforts to provide hot meals for NHS staff during the COVID-19 pandemic. Their work led to almost £1 million in donations to the Feed NHS scheme and partnerships with chains including Leon and Wasabi. Paying tribute to McCrory Online, the Inside No. 9 co-creator and star Reese Shearsmith described her as always immaculate and brilliant. An unfathomable loss. Matt Lucas, who wrote and performed the Baked Potato song as part of the Feet NHS initiative said that McCrory will be remembered, not just for her remarkable stage and screen performances, but also for her selflessness and generosity. She and Damien were the motor-driving Feet NHS, working tirelessly during the pandemic to raise millions for others. What a tremendous loss. Michael Sheen who played Chris Tarrant in Quiz, ITV's drama about the coughing scandal on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, which saw McCrory portray Charles and Diana Ingram's barrister, said that the actor was so funny, so passionate, so smart and one of the greatest actors of our time. From the first moment I met her, when we were just kids it was obvious she was very special. It was an honor to work with her and know her. Jim Hoek. The actor who worked with McCrory and Lewis on the 2015 comedy film Bill paid tribute to McCrory, tweeting, This is so shocking and sad. Helen along with Damien were both terrific fun on Bill. She was so generous with her time and her performance. I urge everyone to listen to her Desert Island discs. What a talent we have lost. McCrory is survived by Lewis, whom she married in 2007 and their two children Mainan and Gulliver. E. Morta of 52 Annie Latrice Britannica Helen McCrory. Adenunziarlo e Stato Suo Marito, Latter Damien Lewis. McCrory era nota sopratuto per aver interpretato il personaggio di Polly Gray nella serie televisiva Peaky Blinders e per aver recitato in tree film della saga di Harry Potter, interpretando Narcissa Malfoy. Nel 2006 Aviva Interpretato Chiri Blair, Mogli del ex primo ministro britannico Tony Blair, Nel film The Queen. Aviva Repressa lo stesso rulo ancient un film del 2010, 
I do Presidente. The award-winning Peaky Blinders actress who also appeared in his Dark Materials and the Harry Potter and James Bond film franchises died today in London. She was 52. McCrory's husband, the Billions actor Damien Lewis, announced her death on Twitter. He said she died peacefully at home after a heroic battle with cancer. She died as she lived. Fearlessly. God, we love her and know how lucky we are to have had her in our lives. She blazed so brightly. Go now, little one, into the air, and thank you, added Lewis. Below is his statement in full.